Hi. Today, I want to talk to you about Wise Feline. Wise Feline is a utility AI plugin for Unreal which allows you to make dynamic and immersive AI for your games. To use this plugin, the first thing to do is to create a behavior asset. You can do this using the Wise Feline submenu of the context menu of the content browser. When you made your behavior and opened its panel by double-clicking on it, you see multiple columns. The columns are actions, considerations, and details. You can add actions which you made either in C++ or Blueprint to the behavior set. I choose shoot here and add it. Then I can add a consideration for the action like ammo. When you choose a consideration, you can change the curve it uses to calculate its score. I add some keys and then click on normalize and make it. I also can choose an external curve which I've made before. When you select an action, you can change variables of the class or its parent classes to customize the action. When you save your behavior, you should assign this behavior to your actors. You need to add the wise feline brain component to your actor, character or AI controller of a character. I added the brain component to the AI controllers of my character. If you want to add it to other actors, you can easily do it like this. When brain component is added, you can set the behavior in the details panel. Now if you press play, this behavior controls the actor. Probably you are thinking about debugging this and want to know how to debug it. To debug your AI, you can use one or more of the three ways which we'll discuss one by one. The first is to press the apostrophe key and use gameplay debugger. You can switch between different AIs using plus and minus keys and then observe their actions and their scores. You can even sort the actions by scores. The second way is to open Wise Feline Debugger from the Tools menu. When you run the game, you can easily select any AI in the game and check its actions and considerations and their scores to debug them. The third way is to use the visual logger. You can open it using the tools, then debug and then visual logger menu. When you open it you can press start to record all behaviors and then pause the game and move between different frames and then select some actors to check their state. I select these three. You can see this actor was going from shoot action to get pickup action. They turn red when changing actions. If they are blue, it means they are executing their previous action. You can this easily observe all AI behaviors of your actors. All variables of each AI actor can be observed too. For example, the controller one actor which was moving toward its target, we can see what actions it had and each of them were in what state. We can see what was the selected target and everything else. All public variables of actions are visible here. Also you can check the considerations too.
This is the overall way that the plugin works. The documentation contains much more details which you can find by going to the plugins window and finding the Wise Feline plugin. You can check both the website and the documentation from here. Thanks for watching.